you this demon driver back again and uh, this is the MD80 tail section here this is the tail section I've done my it's hot wired out I've done my preliminary cutting with the razor just to get excess foam off here's my MD80 all right I'm gonna use this as reference to uh, you know for sanding got a dust mask on I'm going to start off with the mouse because it's a lot easier. Um, take a marker, you mark the very top, the very side, the very other side, the very bottom, down the center. You don't want to sand into that because that's where the profile of the MD90 uh, tail is, so you don't want to screw that up. You don't want to mess that up. Alright, here we go. Let me make sure that I'm in. And I'm in the uh, frame there. Good. All right. What I'm doing is I'm moving straight down getting rid of these bumps. I'm evening it out and going straight down the, uh, the fuselage, straight down the piece. basically rounding out the piece to match your forward hot wire cut. That's what you want to match right there. Everything's got to follow that. Thank <laughs> you. 
I'm probably going to have to spackle in this area here because I, when I hot wired it, I came in a little too close here. So that's got to be hot, uh, spackled. Now I can come in with a little hand sander, which is basically the hand, the hand equivalent of that. And I can get a little bit more gentle, gentle touch when I do it this way. going straight up and down, always being mindful of the contour, and all, it, it's better to take off less than more. If you take off too much, that's where you got to come in with spackle. And that's when, uh, that's when you know you messed up, you didn't, you took too much off the plane. You don't want to do that. You want to take off just enough and that's it. You don't want to take too much off. I had done in just a few minutes. The mouse sander makes a big difference. I strongly suggest getting one. time I hold up the uh, the MD80 nose, I mean the MD80 tail section, and I compare it to that, so, you know, it's a continuous uh, balancing act, you know, you want to, I want to get as scale as I can. If it isn't scale, what's the point? You know, I'm never going to get it 100% scale, but you know, now I'm coming in with a foam pad. These are great. This is by 3M, but there are others that are made by Norton. 100, 150, 200. That's the grit, not the price. <laughs> That's the grit. So I'm coming in. And this will give it even finer, a finer finish to it. Now on this side, I really got to come in with the spackle. I got to stop goofing with that side. So.
and by holding it up I'm able to see uh, little discrepancies that need to be fixed. So, and that's going to happen. You're going to spot stuff. And you got to be able to uh, You gotta be able to rectify those problems. I mean, I, I got a lot of work ahead of me. Got to get stuff done in here. But the general curvature and everything, I got to put drywall, lightweight spackle in there, fold that in. But there's light at the end of the tunnel now. Alright, 
was Demon Driver with more sanding action coming up. Alright you guys, take care, God bless.